my goodness, how did we get to video 42, 43, 42? How do we get to video 42 and I'm talking about how I have a dragon boat racing habit in video one or video two and then I can't even like uh, show you dragon boating. Well, you know what? It's dragon boat practice today and the lack of dragon boat videos ends now. This is our really big long dragon boat. As I promised, it's a really, 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 really long canoe with scales painted on the side to look like a dragon. To get it down to the water, we have to manually carry it. Actually, we put it on a dolly that one of our uh, teammates built for us. And we wheel this gigantic boat thing all the way down to the dock where we put it in the water by hand. There's the dolly that we used to move the boat. Time to gear up and get ready for warm ups.
Drinking water, you see it? One of the benefits of living in the south is that we have a lot of warm days to have pets outside. Look at that. They can see all of us. Yay! Yay! I was worried. That you might be off camera and yeah. not be able to be seen? Yeah, absolutely. And check this out. My phone ran out of battery, so my brother is lending me the world's giantest battery pack. This is what happens when you go to sleep at night and don't plug your phone in. Which is kind of how my phone ran out of battery. Just kind of. You know, normally I'd be upset about spilling water all over myself, but I'm totally coated in water. So you're still driving okay. boat. It was fun. Dragon boating's fun. Did you see how much fun it was? You go out on a boat and then you basically stop and just hang out on the water. Yeah, I noticed on a that. Boat. <laughs> I noticed that and then my battery started getting really low. Yeah. Twice. Yeah. One of the guys. Then, like, once my battery was completely dead, you guys were like, alright, let's floor it. I'm like, well, <laughs> I'm not gonna get footage of this. <laughs> yeah, one of the guys on the boat was an engineer and he's like, well, I mean you can just like put the rest of the batteries in a waterproof bag and have it just dangle from the boat or er, from the drone by a very very long lightweight cable and he can just drag the, the floaty bag of extra battery along with him That's interesting <laughs> have continuous battery charge interesting idea and i said yeah i think he's just taking it back to put a new battery in and i was like jeff has multiple batteries he'll surely just change them out yeah well did you at least get good shots of uh, of the crew people practicing? Crew people, you guys? No, the, the people in the skulls, the guys going backwards. Ah, I didn't bother them. Oh, I noticed you kind of buzzed over in their direction. So. No, I was just trying to get. I thought you guys had stopped because uh, one of the people on your dragon boat said if the drone's too close to us, we can't hear the command. So I was. Oh, they met really close. You were fine. You were well, always I, fine. I kept, Did you see? You guys... We kept giving you thumbs ups and like waving at you. No, nah, uh, that's too far away. I thought you guys were stopped because the drone was interfering, so I pulled it back here and pulled it up higher or something like that. No, you were having a good time. You weren't terribly close. Any Although guys? in the summer I used to like that because it was like air conditioning from the drone wings. The drone propellers. Okay, it is too windy. Okay, YouTube, it's too windy. You gotta go. Enjoyed having lunch with my brother and me? Well, now we're off to my mom's house where I'm going to take a nap before I do a dog sitting trial run because that's one of the things, dog sitting trial runs. Um, certain, to put it politely and tactfully, more cautious dog sitting people. Uh, other people might call them neurotic. Tend to prefer to wait out on the porch or the balcony and watch you take care of their dog for a trial run while they can see how you are treating the dog correctly. Sorry, I need to take a moment and process what just happened. I had a fully green light, a car in front of me was turning right, a car 
was waiting to make a left hand turn the car in front of me turned right and i went straight and the car that was waiting to make the left hand turn nearly hit me and i'm not sure why that happened other than you know people are dumb or perhaps they were waiting like after this car i'm gonna go but uh but see they shouldn't have because i had the right of way traveling straight. I did not have a turn signal on. It was not indicating a turn. Anyway, on to my mom's house. So I found somebody who knows the point of a pre-wash cycle. My mama! Look at her hand. The only reason I can think of that you would want a pre-wash cycle is if you have something so filthy that one washing is not going to take out the stains anyway. So you're kind of combining a half a wash with another wash. So mom, why don't you just run it through the laundry twice? Uh, it might save some soap and some water and some electricity to do it this way. So in a sense, just running it through twice is okay. No, you can peel an orange with a spoon. Okay, yes, you can. can. probably need to go potty.
two, three doggies. Ah, ah, ah.